Okay, so this is, uh, this is our GeForce Experience software, um, and coming on June 25th, we are enabling a new feature called Shadow Play. So the Shadow Play, you see the button right up there, you go click that button, and what it's going to allow you to do is uh, record your gameplay experience in a way that you've never been able to do it before. Because what Shadow Play does is use the built-in video encoder on all of our Kepler GPUs to record your gameplay in a very efficient manner. And because it's so efficient to, to record, you basically take a, a negligible impact to, to your frame rates. It'll be typically less than 5%. And because there's basically no impact to your frame rates, you actually can just turn this on and leave it on all the time. So I'll turn it on right here and um, select a, a, a new mode called, uh, called Shadow Mode. And again, because there's a neg negligible impact to your frame rate, I can, I can enable this new mode. Um, I can select a shadow time. Here I've just selected two minutes. And what this will do now is it'll automatically be recording the last two minutes of my gameplay. So I'm going to go ahead and, and fire up a game. Uh, I'm going to launch Borderlands 2. Um, I've, got the, I've got Shadow Play on. And now I'm just going to turn it on and leave it on. And I can leave it on as I'm playing any one of my games, all of my games. I can leave it on, and it'll be automatically recording the last two minutes of my gameplay. And can you adjust that? Can you make it longer? You can move it to whatever you like. I just set it for two minutes. You can go to one minute. You can make it up to 20 minutes. So you can select whatever, um, however long you would like to, to be recording your gameplay. Um, and like I said, you can just turn it on and leave it on. I can go play any game. And then anytime you have you know, an epic gaming moment, uh, anytime you do something great on your PC, you just hit a hotkey, and it'll automatically save the last two minutes of your, of your gameplay. Um, so we're firing up Borderlands 2. Um, you can see in the in the lower right that little icon there tells you that Shadow Play is active. Um, so that means it's on. It's it's um, it's automatically recording the the like as I said, set it for two minutes, so it's automatically recording the last two minutes of of your gaming. And so now here I am. I'm back in that same scene. Um, I'll pull out my uh, my same gun here. And uh, I'm recording now. And again, take a look at the frame rate. Uh, I'm I'm back up around 46 at this point, as if uh, as if I wasn't recording anything. But it's on and it's actually auto recording. So I'm going to go through and just game again, um, just like I did before. Uh, but now again, note that the the frame rates are high. Um, I'm not really noticing any difference between um, having the the shadow play recording on or not. Uh, but it is doing the auto recording. So I go through here and let's say. Um, you know, take it that something something great happens, I can go and hit a hotkey, and I've just saved the last two minutes of my gameplay. And I can just keep on gaming, I just keep going. Okay. Um, and any game you want, you just go through any time you want, uh, any time you want to capture something you just did, hit the hotkey, and it'll record the, the last two minutes of my gameplay, oh, or whatever I set it to do. So what kind of file does it output to you? Um, it saves it in H.264 format, so it saves it in a nice compact file. Um, you know, it's a file that's already been compressed, and it's ready to go. You can just grab that file, up right, upload it right up to YouTube or, or however you want to share it. You know, it gives you a nice, compact, manageable file. So, yes, I think that's the problem with, uh, with FRAPS is that those files are often... Yeah, they can, they can be large, and you know, because they're not compressed. They're, they're, they're just raw video footage. So, you know, again, one of the great things about this is not only does it not impact your, your frame rates, not only does it give you nice, compressed, and compact files, but it really allows you to record your gaming in a way you've never done it before. Because you can always leave it on, now you can just have it on anytime you're gaming. You can save, um, you can save some of your, your, your best gaming moments that you just were never able to record before. You know, we've all had that experience where we just did something that you couldn't believe, and you would love to be able to capture that and share it. Well, now you can with Shadowplay. So which, uh, which cards will it support? So this uses the, the um, built-in video encoder on all our Kepler GPUs. So you need a, a GeForce GTX 650 or better uh, in order to get this feature. But it comes starting on June 25th. It'll come with GeForce Experience, so it's free to anyone, to all our GeForce gamers. Uh, and anyone with a GTX 650 or better is, is, uh, is going to be able to enjoy this feature. Cool. Thank you, Justin. Sure. Thank you.